Staying or leaving? Timothy, the doctor started. Timothy, you physically beat it up another patient. All I have to say is, why? He... She attacked Brian and the new girl. I think her name's Madison. I replied, still shaking and sniffing from crying. Yes, I've heard of her. She has some sort of ticking disorder. Tourette's, I think. She also has ADHD and schizophrenia. I want you to stay away from her, Timothy. I was shocked. Why did she want me to stay away from her? What's her full name? I asked. Madison Tara Reed. Her family calls her Tara. Why? I asked. It's from a superhero name her older brother gave her. It was a uh, ticking Tara or something like that. Why are you telling me all of this? I asked. You're smart, and I thought you could help her, but after you beat it up another patient, I don't think you can. If you tell anyone this information, I will send you somewhere else. You mean another facility? I asked. Yes, she said, glaring at me. I won't tell anyone, I said. Then I felt sick again. I started coughing and coughing and coughing. I couldn't stop. I was having a coughing fit. The doctor panicked and got me some water. Then it happened. I started to cough up blood. That's when I passed out. I remember very vaguely me waking up, but it wasn't me. I felt possessed again. I walked over to the doctor and said, I can tell anyone any information I want. I kept walking toward her. The look on her face, it was pure terror. And I can talk to anyone I want. You can't tell me what to do. Look who's, look who's sitting on the floor scared. And look who's standing with power. That's when I tried to tackle the doctor. But she grabbed me and called some of the nurses to put me to sleep, as they said. They put this shot in my arm and I calmed down and fell asleep. Nurse Hope carried me back to my room. When I woke up, she sat there with me. While I was crying, she was hugging. She reminded me a lot of my big sister. She's six years older than me, so she would be 16 right now. She was so nice, and I miss her so much. I want to go home. I will go home. But for now, I can't. I have to stay here. I have to protect Brian and Madison, no matter what. I must do everything I can, and I, and I need to stay here and help my friends.